everybody and welcome back to my channel. I'm so happy that you wanted to join me today because today I'm giving you the first actual views of my new apartment. I am very excited to show you. I moved in last month, exactly a month ago actually, and I've been using this past month just um, you know, improving this space, making it really my own, making it a place I really want to be. And I've done that primarily by making stuff myself. I've been building some things, I've been improving some things that was already here. And I've acquired a few new items, most of which are secondhand. I have cement on my arm. This video is sponsored by Mapperfall, a site where you can create your own posters with any sort of geological place on it. And I've been really thinking about getting something like this for my apartment because maybe you know this, I was in Beijing for two weeks in the summer and I was supposed to stay there for five months, four months, something like that, for a long time. And I had to cut the trip short because I was so different sad. Um, but when I was walking around in Beijing, what really just kept me going and what I was thinking about a lot was how good a life I had here in Oldburg. And I really wanted something like a centerpiece of my apartment to symbolize how much I adore the city and how much I appreciated it after I came home and how much I appreciated it when I was away. Um, so I got this poster saying double A, which is a fun way of saying Oldburg. Uh, there's two A's in Oldburg, that is why well, it's funny. Um, and then I have a map over Oldberg, I can see everything, and then it says Dublin, Northern Jutland. And I look at this every day, it's sort of the centerpiece of my heart in my living room because I don't have a television and I don't need one, you. But this, this post has sort of become the, the centerpiece because this is something I want to think about every single day how much I appreciate where I am and how much I appreciate my friends and my family and just the people I love. So yeah, now on to some of the other projects I have been going in the apartment to make it look more like me and to make it feel like home. One of the first things I did when I moved into my new place was getting a lot of plants. The place I lived before I didn't have any sunlight so I couldn't really have anything living in there. So when I got all of this new light I really wanted to just have a load of greens and I'm getting even more plants. Fun fact, some of the plants are actually second-hand. I bought them via Tradono and also my pots and my vases are second-hand as well. Another thing that I did that I really love is that I turned two wooden crates into my sofa table. I really, really adore that. I am eventually getting another table, um, but it's at my mom's atelier right now, so I really, really like this for now and maybe it will, it will stay this way for a while. I also built my own bench, which I'm quite proud of because I'm not really that handy. I found scrap wood just lying around everywhere and some of the scrap wood is actually something that was thrown away that I repurposed. And then I just made a bench because I had this idea that I wanted my dining room table with the two chairs and then like a social dining bench um, that you can sit on and just chill out. So that's what I made. I'm really, really happy with it and like the way it turned out. I generally wanted the apartment to be this mix of metals and wood, so we have the, the dead things, or the very industrial things, and then we have the living things, and the natural things. Um, and I think that's some small that detail, see how this wooden block also just in the corner chilling. I hope you enjoyed just my wee tiny apartment glimpses. I sure loved making this video. I am going to make a official tour, but that will be the whole apartment when everything is set and everything is done. Right now the apartment looks just completely mental, I'm sure you're going to feature just right now because I've been making lino cut which I'm really excited about and I talked to you guys on Instagram because I really wanted to do some sort of merch, some sort of thing um, that you can buy that you can sort of support my work with and I really want to do lino cut on a canvas bags so you can use them when you go to the farmer's market or when you shop in bulk but my premature merch you can also acquire if you're interested in that. The way to do so is by going to my Patreon and supporting me with $10 or more that will provide you with a cut that I made with my hands. Yes. Um, but yeah, I'm super, super proud of what I've been doing so far and I think I will only get better with practice and with time. Um, but if you're interested in these very first samples, you can of course hit my Patreon and see what it's all about. 
I really enjoyed making this video and hope that you liked it. If you did, leave me a thumbs up and you can also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. That would make my day. Leave me a comment with your best interior or decor tip. I would love to know what sort of things that you do around your place that make it more like you. And just take care of yourselves. Until next time, see you guys. Bye!